This video did not go as planned. We went from a full happy tube to a tube connected to an outworld to an almost empty tube. Did they escape? I was warned that they were tiny. Let's at least start how I wanted to start this video. Welcome to the Crafting Ant channel. In the last video, I showed you our new colony. Let's talk a bit more about them. The species is called Temnothorax nilandri, or acorn ants, and they are some of the smallest ants of Europe, but they are found all over the world. And as the name suggests, they like to live in acorns, or other nuts, or wood. The species can be polygynous, that means that they can have more than one queen in a colony. They can have up to a thousand workers, and they hibernate from November to March. Since the colony is already of a decent size, I'm going to give them an outworld. And of course, we are going to make it ourselves. I bought a nice storage bin at a shop. Now we just need to make a connector for our queen tube room and something for ventilation. After a few tries I made this connector at the right angle and curve. So now it's time to build. Let's connect the tube and see if they like it. At first they were a bit insecure about their surroundings, so I left them for a bit. About 15 minutes later I was able to take out the cotton and place a tray with a worm and a drop of sugar water. And within an hour it was gone, so I decided to give him a bit more. I had to leave for about 15 minutes. When I came back into my ant room, a chill went through my spine. An almost empty test tube. Also no movement in the outworld. I grabbed my camera to re-watch those 15 minutes.
All the movement went to the wood I placed earlier. I changed the camera to see what happened around the corner. And there they were. I knew the twig was hollow when I placed it, but I didn't expect them to move in. I'm really happy that they didn't escape, but chose a spot in the outworld to call home. Last episode, I asked you guys for a name, and the most votes were on the dangleberries. So from now on, this colony will be named the dangleberries. Thank you all for watching, and please don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time at the Crafting Ant.